guys welcome back to my channel so today I have got a makeup review that I wanted to share with you guys I am um, me and my husband we're out doing a little bit of errands and uh, we stopped by what we have um, over where I live called the uh, Dollar Tree and um, we were actually going there uh, just to get a few uh, water enhancement flavors or just check and see what they had because our store didn't have what we wanted Anyways, while we were going in there, I noticed um, that they had these little goodies. And I was intrigued, actually, to see what a $1.25 um, makeup actually gives you. And what actually started it was this lip gloss. Um, and so I started uh, really looking, and then I seen this eyeshadow, and I was like, oh, you know what, that might be a, a fun video to do. So I uh, I got them and I wanted to see what the pigmentation was and uh, kind of do a review on them for anyone else that has seen them and was interested. So yeah, so before we get started, I would just like to ask anyone that is taking the time out of their day watching my videos, if you wouldn't mind, to please like, subscribe, and uh, share this video. So yeah, guys, let's uh, get uh, get into it. I've already uh, put the moisturizer and uh, foundation on. Kind of cut this video a little short. Use the Super Goop foundation, and I also used uh, the Anastasia Brow Wiz. So uh, yeah, so here is the uh, eyeshadow. I'm gonna take this little gadget out because I wouldn't use that. But I just thought that was actually really pretty. So there's that. And then it says uh, lip gloss moisturizing. And this is uh, the color cheerful. New look, vitamin E enriched and it's uh, LA colors. So never heard of this brand before. And so, and it looks like this. And then this other color I got was uh, happiness. I don't know why, I mean, I've been in there before and I've just never noticed the, uh, the makeup. Never guess went down that aisle. Um, so, it's, uh, and this one was more, so I'll do swatches first. We'll see. So that's pretty. And then here's for this one. Not bad for a $1.25 gloss, to be honest. So I guess I should see what kind of scent. Okay, it's kind of like that, like that one had like a bubble gum scent. Ooh, that one's trying to have like a fruity, but it does have a little bit of something. I'm not quite sure what it is behind it. I do like this one better as far as scent wise. So wipe those off and then we'll do the swatch of the eyeshadows. So we'll do this one first. Oh, wow. I was not expecting that at all, to be honest. Okay. All right, LA girl, I see you. I see you. Okay. Well, for $1.25, I wasn't expecting that kind of uh, pigmentation at all. So, let's uh, see what kind of look we can do. Uh, I'm going to go in on the eyelid. I think we'll do the glitter on the eyelid. I'm gonna look down here at my mirror down below, kinda. So yeah, that that's a little shocking. I wasn't expecting it to be that pigmented when I did the swatches. I mean, but I'd really have to dig in there. So, everyone's having a, a good weekend. And today we're gonna go check out the farmer's market, see what they, uh, it's their second weekend. So I'm not quite sure what all they've got happening vegetable wise, but wanted to just kind of go out, enjoy the weather a little bit and see what they've got going on. So we're gonna do the brown here. Oh, the fallout, I mean, it doesn't have a lot of fallout. It's just hair. Very, very impressed actually. For $1.25, um, wow, okay. I haven't uh, gotten out to the mall yet to check out the Sephora, so I thought, well, we'll do this. This is actually coming out to be very pretty. I like this. I am a little shocked. I did not have high hopes for this, to be honest with all of you. 
And so I'm sitting here kind of like, wow. Okay. Now we'll uh, do this color for under the eyebrow. Okay. And then we'll uh, do a brown eyeliner. I'm just going to hold on to the corner of my eye. Nice. Okay. I don't do that very often on camera. Makes me nervous. I did have a sample of the uh, Milk Kush uh, Mascara. And so we're going to use that today. Okay. And then we will use the... I'm going to mix it up a little bit here, I think. Let's see. I haven't used this in a while. I'm trying to... Nope. That's not what I thought. There was, I had a blush. Yep, right here it is, the Wet n Wild. I got this and it's also called, oh, that is so funny, you guys. Uh, it's the Wet n Wild and it's called Pinch Me Pink, but it's in the powder. That's funny. Okay, and then uh, just our normal highlight, the Benefit Cookie. Oh, where is she at? There she is. I try to get all my brushes laid out so I'm not taking forever and then they like to roll around. Okay, so now we're going to get to these and I think I'm going to stick with the clear. So let's do the uh, first one, this one first. Okay, so this one is pretty. I do like this one, but I don't like the smell of it. It just smells kind of like a strawberry went bad. That's what it smells like, guys. I don't know what it, what it is. I can't put my finger on it. It just doesn't, it, 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 that's exactly the only thing I can tell you guys is it just smells like a strawberry went bad. It's like, uh, no, I can't, can't do that. Mm -mm. Well, hmm, interesting. This doesn't smell like that. The, this one was the cheerful. No, this one was the happiness. So, okay. Yeah, and this one just smells like bubble gum. Okay. Yeah, and I do like this one. This one is nice. But I'm just shocked that uh, it was a dollar dollar twenty five. And this really has shocked me. Dollar twenty five. All right, guys. So that's the look. And um, I I'm really impressed uh, by all of them. To be honest with you, I mean, other than the smell of this, but I mean the color is pretty. I mean, it, the smell might not bother somebody else. So um, I would, I would definitely say go to, if you have a, a Dollar Tree, go and uh, check out the LA Colors. Um, very impressive with uh, their product. I'm, I'm very, sh I'm shook. I'm shook by uh, their, um, their makeup. I'm gonna have to go see what else that they've got now. So anyways, guys, uh, please like and subscribe. Um, and I want to welcome all of my new subscribers that I've gotten. And of course, my old subscribers that have, uh, are sticking with me. I appreciate each and every one of you. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye, guys.